Hey everyone, how you doing? It's me, Joe, and welcome back to Exile. We are carrying on from pretty much the same place that I was in in the last part. It's actually been a few days since I last recorded that. I was up on that hill overlooking that mission. Uh, I did find a car when I, I logged in, but I crashed it. It did have a thousand pop tabs in it though. So you can see down the bottom now, I've got a thousand pop tabs on me. So it's actually probably best to check cars now, just see if they're open to get um, just random pop tabs sitting there. So I am currently, oh hang on. A brute force hack is detected on the grid. Okay. Let's go check that out. I have no idea what that is. It's right next to me, like 800 meters away. So let's go and check this out. I was going to head to the uh, trader. So I need to pay my um, territory charge thing so I can keep my base. I was going to head that way, but I'm going to head up here now. <laughs> I don't know what the hell it is. I think this might mean someone's hacking into someone's base. I don't know. It's actually been a right pain in the ass to get to this. Uh, this whatever the hell this is I'm going towards. It's right up on this hill. I had to climb up it. It took me ages. So I I don't know what this is. Hacker activity. It's got to be someone hacking a safe or getting in someone's base. Because because to get into people's safes in this, you have to uh, use a laptop and hack into it. So we're really close to it now. So I need to be I need to be careful. Okay, I think there's a base right here because I can see a workbench. So I'm assuming there's someone trying to hack something over here. It's a hundred meters away. Yeah, there's a base, look. I think someone's hacking that base right now. What the hell? It's also moved the floor so you can't actually even get in. I don't know what's going on here. I really don't. I can't get into space. The door, front door's open, but the floor's missing. I don't know. Maybe there is someone up there hacking a safe. I have no idea. But I can't get in there. So I don't know what to do. I don't know. God, it took me a while to get up here, so they might have done it and left already. I don't know. I guess I just have to leave it. I could go down this path here, which is where they would have come up from. Let's do that. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Jesus, where the hell is that from? Wow. Okay, <laughs> well, I guess I'll be respawning then. Oh yeah, just to give you guys a bit of a heads up as well. Um, Apex is coming out in a couple of days, as I'm recording this. And I've a couple of people have said on the server that the server's going to wipe. Once the Apex is actually out, they're going to start again. So, just a heads up in case that does happen. I'll try and do the same as what I did before. Build a new base and you know get loads of pop tabs and just try and gear up again. But, I guess we'll, we'll see. Has this got pop tabs in? Nope. Okay, because I need to pay for my uh, plot pole, I'll do that now. Uh, up, uh, no, pay territory protection money. It's pretty cheap, 950 pop tabs, so that's nothing. To pay it? It didn't say paid. I guess it has though, because money's gone out of my account, so. Right, well, so when's it June now? So I can actually check my phone. And see when it's due. Uh, the territory uh, due on the 19th. So bearing in mind that this server hasn't left, uh, you know, gone by then, I have until the 19th to pay my protection money again, which is a long, long time. We've got tons of money, which I'll actually get some out because I need to buy some more gear. Okay, so I've spent like half my pop tabs now, uh, gearing back up. I've bought a nice, decent gun, all camo. Uh, I was going to get another ghillie suit. But I decided not to. I've decided to go with this instead. Um, yeah, I think it looks pretty cool. I think this would be uh, pretty camoed in the in the bushes. But then I'll follow the ghillie suit. Uh, there's another hacker activity apparently. This is the same one. I think it's the same one. I might have just done it again. I don't know. There's something else I wanted to say as well. Um, a lot of people ask me. Well, not say a lot. Pretty much. Most of the comments I get on every single Excel video is what server do I play on. 
Um, I don't like giving out the server name that I play on. It's not a secret. You can see it on all my XR videos. If you're that desperate want to know what server I play on, go back and watch my previous videos. I show you the server by accident. Well, not by accident. I just show it on that on there um, on those videos. If you're that desperate to find it. But the reason I don't like giving out uh, the server is because back when I used to play Armor 2 on Epoch, where you used to do base building, uh, I had a base for ages. It was hidden in the middle of nowhere. Pretty impossible to find. Uh, I gave it out to everyone of my um, all my subscribers. Said, "Oh, I'm on this server. Come join." As a, you know, a kind gratitude for people to come and play with me. You know, potential kills and stuff. But then a day later, my base got completely blown up. My cars destroyed. So, you know, it was down. And I had people on Twitter messaging me saying, "Ha ha, we destroyed your base." So I don't like the fact that giving out my server, the server I play on, just pr promotes that. Basically, it makes me want to do that, and I don't like that. So. That's the reason I don't give out the server. I know not everyone would do that, but a lot of people know where my base is. Um, what is this quad bike doing? <laughs> a lot of people know where my base is, uh, so it's not a fair raid. I don't care if I get raided. Not like I went anything my base, but you know I think they can still take my base and stuff if they get in, it, get in. But it's not fair if someone knows where my base is and they literally join the server, go there and raid it. It's you know it's not a fair raid. Whereas if someone who doesn't know who I am just stumbles with my base, raids it, you know that's fair enough. Like I said, due to past experiences where I have given out the server I play on, and people have only come on the server to destroy my stuff, you know, that's why I don't like giving it out. And like I said, it's not a secret. You can go and watch my old videos if you really want to, and you watch the video and you can see the uh, server name comes up on the screen a couple of times. So if you're that desperate, go back and watch the vid videos. But if you do come on, just don't um, specifically come on to destroy my base because it's it's not really fair otherwise because you know my base is I'm saying uh, there are people on this server right now who are, are subscribers of mine because they keep saying oh it's Jolly Joe oh hello Jolly Joe I, I just I, I, I might sound like a dick saying it but I just don't like I don't like that I don't like joining servers where there's people on that you know me I never have I don't know why I just it just feels awkward I think it'd be the same sort of thing if someone ever recognised me in the street. It'd be like, you know, it'd be awkward. I just, I don't really like playing games when there's people sitting there trying to basically say, "Oh my god, I love you, Joe. Oh, Joe, do you want to meet up? I'm, big, I'm a big fan. I don't, I just don't like all that. I, I don't. I think I'm too nice to say no. That's my issue. If someone asks me something, I either have to ignore them because I have to say no, and you know, I, I don't like saying no to people. So, I think that's my main problem here. My car's been unlocked this whole time. <laughs> I don't know if it unlocks over time. Maybe it does. But I haven't been to this car in a long time. It's unlocked. So, <laughs> oh well. Oh yeah, I've got some stuff in here. I've got all these like tools and axes and some food and stuff. Which I got. I got rope because I think you can tow things on this server. I'm not sure. So I did get that. But yeah, you need a handsaw for cutting wood and things, so I've kept all my tools in here. I've got tents if I need tents to put up in my base. But I'm not that bothered at the minute, really. Um, I'll lock that back up. I think it's locked now. It's not locking. Okay, well, it's not locking. It's like... When I put the pin in, it's not even saying it's the wrong code. It's just not doing anything. I tried getting the driver's seat, and that's not worked. So I don't think I can lock my car. It's just going to stay here unlocked. Oh, well. I think I'll lock this door. I can't even get the option. Where, why can't I get out of my base now? There's no options. I unlocked my to get out my door. What the hell? Oh no. There's no option. I'm stuck in my base. Help me. Oh good, I got it. The options are lock it. What's going on? So this is my other car. I put this car here. This I cut it out of the video, but I bought a golf in the last part and I drove it back to my base, and it's unlocked. It's just sitting here unlocked, and it doesn't. It's not letting me lock it. So I don't know what's going on in the server, but look, I can't even get in the driver's seat. Like I'm literally just put the code in. It's the, it's the right code, and it's not locking it. Well, I'm gonna have to just leave it there because. Hasn't been found. I was gonna go and check out the base just down the road, the one, um, the Dalton Green one. There's none of them on the server, but 
I don't know. They might have a. Uh, it might not even be there anymore. Let's go and check. Let's go and find out. Now I don't think there's anyone here. I looked in in the top from the hill and I couldn't see anyone on the roof. And um, the door's locked. I haven't seen. Can't see anyone. So they're not on the server. So I just assume there's no one here. That's fine. Let's uh, head back out then. Do you know what might be nice? Heading back to that place where I died and get revenge. Because the hacking activity is still there, so I reckon there's still people around. So I want to head over in this direction and see if I can um, get revenge on that. I can't remember his name. Give him an L. It was like La Lana or Larson or something. I can't remember. Larsa. I can't remember. But yeah, I want to see if I can go up there. Maybe I'll take it nice and slow. I'm not going to run straight up there like I did before. But um, I thought there would just be a couple of people in a base and I could shoot them. I didn't think there would be people down that path. And if they were, I didn't think they'd be looking at me. I thought they'd be uh, running away. But, yeah, they killed me. I died. Maybe there was someone in the base hacking it. Whilst there were people down on the path defending it. And they heard me open the door, maybe. So they said to the people on the path, you know, there's someone up at the house. And then when they came up, they uh, they just killed me. I don't know. Helly. Heck! The round is right next to me. What happened there? What the hell? There's a guy here. Where'd he go? Oh, there's a tent here. Oh my god, there's a base. It's empty though. I've no idea where that guy went. He, he started sprinting up the hill. He had his gun on his back. I'm not doing the same because if he stopped. I don't know where this guy went. This is terrifying, this jungle. I hate it. Oh, it's actually horrifying. None of these people up in these woods around, like in this jungle, in this area. I heard shots coming up here as well. So, I saw a guy. He managed to run away. I have no idea where he went. But I want to get down to this, down here. This is where I want to get. Cause this is the path that leads up to there. And that's where I got shot from, down this bit here. I got shot down here, so if I can get up to this hill, I can look down onto the path. That's what I want to do. Okay, so I don't know if you can see, just down here, this is the path which, which I was running down when I got shot at. That was a long time ago, so I doubt they're still in the same place, but if they're part of the people hacking this, because I guess they might be using it for bait. Put that on the map, people get going up there, and then they just kill them. So I reckon that's what they're doing. I reckon they're camping this path that leads up to it. Who knows? So I'm gonna try and sneak round to see if I can get sight on anyone. Maybe. Go right there. That looks like a giddy guy standing right there. That's not in the tree. I thought he was standing on the path. <laughs> oh, that's scary. I got one. <laughs> I knew it, man. I knew they'd be on this path. I killed Chippin. It's not the guy who killed me. I'm guessing he's on his own. I'm going to go for his body. No money on him. 
got an instant dock, I'll take that. Do I go up there? I'm gonna die if I go up there. I'm calling it. If I go up there, I'm gonna die. Let's do it. There, there's people up here. I know there is. And they're gonna kill me. I'm pretty sure I died like right here. Oh, I got off my screen. A little bird carrying a little. I don't see the point in that. I think they sell for like 300 those quads. <laughs> That's the point, is really. Yeah, I see there's a guy, there's a giddy guy sitting down there, there's two guys there, and there's a freshborn there. There's a guy there. I've got to look what I'm doing. <laughs> Who did I kill? Oh, it's not the guy. It's not the guy that killed me. Wow. I should. <laughs> he could have, if he looks over here, man, he would have seen me. They died. <laughs> so the heli. There's a guy up there. I knew I saw someone. You see him there, look, he's up there on top of that rock. Every time I look though, he moves. Oh, he's moving up, I see him. It's right there, look. He's moving, every time I peek he moves. God, it's so frustrating. Oh my god, this is so tense, like he's he's behind this rock somewhere now. I don't know oh there he is, he's he's on top of it. He's disappeared again. Every time I peek, he disappears. Just hope he doesn't see. He didn't see me. He just killed someone. The only thing is, I can't move. Someone just got killed from 800 meters away, and it sounded like it hit over here. <laughs> I don't know what's going on, man. I hear explosions, people keep dying around me. I don't even know if this guy's still here anymore. Because they had a shootout, he might have died. Someone might have been in the, in the base and shot him. I don't know. But if I move, if that guy still is alive up there, if I move, he's going to see me because he'll be third person of what I'm doing. 
But I think there's someone in that base because I think they killed him. Either he killed the guy on the base or the base guy killed the guy on the rock. Jesus. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. There's got to be people in that base. There's got to be. See, I, I really don't know what to do. I'm kind of trapped now because stuff is blowing up in that base, so I assume there's someone in there. This guy I don't on this rock, I don't know if he actually died or he's just still sitting up there. I can't see him. I just don't know. I've not seen anyone in the windows or anything in that base. I've just not seen any movement. I just keep hearing shots and explosions. I'm kind of annoyed I didn't get this shot on that guy though, but on that rock. I assume he's been killed because he hasn't moved. Unless he's just doing what I'm doing, just laying and looking to see if he can see anyone. I kept seeing on top of that rock over there, and every time I looked, like, down my scope to shoot him, he'd, he'd moved. And then we got on that rock, I did the same. Every time I just seemed to aim down my sights, he'd disappeared. And that body there I killed, I keep thinking there's someone laying there looking at me every time I look around. I've got a funny feeling that guy's probably going to go back to his body at some point. I've said it for friggin' ages. So he probably will, um, go back up there at some point. I'll have to kill him again. Assuming he will. I don't know. Shut up! Why am I shouting one regroup? <laughs> okay, the hacker's actually gone from the map. So... I don't know if that means like, they died inside. There was that big explosion, so... Maybe someone threw a grenade in there and killed them. But then where the hell did that grenade come from? Or, you know, grenade launcher. I don't know what it was. You know what? I've got some kills now. I feel like I've done pretty good in this video. So, I'm going to sprint across here and get on top of this rock and see that guy's actually set up there. I know, I've got a funny thing. There's definitely someone in that base. And I reckon he's third person over the wall. So, as soon as you go out in the open, he's going to shoot you. So, you'll probably see me run across if he's up there. So, sod it, let's go. I'm gonna die. There's a shot then from miles away. Oh, the parachuting in. What the hell? Did he fall off? I swear he just fell off. <laughs> That's poor shooting though by me. Okay, well I don't know what to do. I don't know where that guy went. I think he just fell off. I don't know if he died. But I think he parachuted onto it, so I don't I don't know what's going on. That body's gone, so I assume it's despawned, at least I hope it has. <laughs> High footsteps. Oh, run out of ammo! Oh, that's embarrassing. God damn it! Screw this. Right, bye guys. End of the. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, whatever. I'm going. Bye. <laughs>